Hi everyone. I welcome you all for this nursing wisdom channel. Today we are going to see about succinctureate placenta. The placenta succinctureata or succinctureate placenta is an abnormality of placenta having succinctureate lobe. Meaning the term succinctureate derives from the Latin word succinctureo meaning to substitute. Definition Succinctureate placenta means there is an accessory lobe present in placenta. It is separate from the main placenta and it is joined to main placenta by leash of blood vessels that run through the membranes. This accessory lobe might be small or big and single or multiple. Incidence The overall incidence is approximately 3 per 1000 pregnancies. This condition occurs in 5% of placentas. Risk factors Risk factors include advanced maternal age, in vitro fertilization, implantation over leiomyomas, in areas of previous surgery, in the corno or over the cervical os. Diagnosis Before delivery, ultrasound, particularly color Doppler, can be used to identify this condition. After delivery, by doing placental examination, can identify. Complication What are the complications occur due to this succinctureate placenta means? First one is retained placenta. The placenta delivered, the accessory lobe remains inside and the midwife or doctor not aware of that lobe present inside of uterus will lead to retained placenta. Then primary PPH If the retained lobe is big, that will interfere with uterine contractility and cause uterine atony that leads to bleed immediately that means primary PPH. Secondary PPH if the retained lobe is small means at that moment it allow uterus to contract well but later interfere with uterine contraction and leads to hemorrhage that is secondary PPH. Infection the retained lobe left for long days may cause infection. Vasa previa, if the vessels running to accessory lobe crosses the presenting port leads to vasa previa. Vasa previa cause fetal hemorrhage at delivery. Prevention Placental examination. After the delivery of placenta, the midwife must examine the placenta for evidence of a retained lobes. After delivery, careful removal of clots and bits from the uterus. If available by doing bedside ultrasound, can confirm any bits retained in the uterus or uterus is empty. I hope you got some idea about placenta succinctureata. Thanks for watching.